you're celebrating New Year's Eve in Modesto, Stockton, maybe Sacramento, maybe Old Sacramento. We have Chef Jay from 1022, and you guys are hosting a dinner for New Year's Eve, correct? We are. It's uh, it's quite the dinner, I'd say. It's a, <laughs> a dinner of about 500 people now. So. Oh my goodness! So tell us about some of the things you'll be preparing. I love what you brought here today. Well, this is uh, one of our signature dishes. This is our duck breast that we do, uh, seared local duck breast from Grimaud Farms, and that's out of Stockton. Mm -hmm. And uh, that's just the breast with no bone. It takes about eight or ten minutes to cook, and we do a little wild mushroom risotto, and this has all been hand forged. And this is locally acquired from the guy that drives up to your door and says, "What kind of mushrooms do you want today?" Nice. So, yeah, we like He's that. He's a real so. mushroom dealer. He is an actual mushroom dealer. So you know. So we if we want to make it at home, if we can't make it down to 1022, what, how would we prepare this? Well, you, this is pretty simple. You get the risotto. You kind of follow the, the directions on the box. You kind of want to pre-do your rice. Do you have a risotto brand that you like over other brands? Well, any arborio rice works. I, there's there's really one that's called Golden Pheasant that I like a lot. Uh -huh. uh, they do polenta as well. I think it's a it's a higher quality product, and the reason is it, it has more crema, and okay. you see that coming out of it now. Mm -hmm. So that's. Basically, what you do is you just get that going, and, and so you start with the risotto. Yeah, saute your mushrooms, get a little fresh garlic in there, a little salt and pepper. You have your uh, duck breast going. Always a need for a little more fresh garlic. Mm -hmm. And uh, basically, that's it. You toss a little collard green that you might pre, uh, pre blanch in there, and uh, and you put that in at the very end. Correct? You do. You don't want anything to get too brown and ugly. So. So are you using a cream? What are you putting in? You know, not a lot of people use cream and risotto. Not a lot of use. Stock. I mm -hmm. like to use a little bit of cream. It just richens it up. What kind of cream is that? that this you is have heavy in that cream. Drop? This uh -huh. is um, Strauss Farm. So, yeah, and that's that. All right. So then you a little you, uh, rosemary in there. You or? do. Or you, I would use that as a garnish, and I just kind of lay that out. And the feature is the mushrooms. Mm -hmm. You know, uh, it's it, it's something that people really enjoy. And it, again, there's people say, well, what's your huh? signature dish? What do you yeah. do? What's your favorite? I don't know. I, I they, you put you in a spot like that, you never really know. But I do know that. The duck is one of my favorite, and I don't like to cut it. A lot of people will slice the duck up, and I'm mm -hmm. kind of unorthodox in that in that respect. And I, I don't want the juice to, to still be in there. Where when do it's you finished. get your so duck from? Grimaud Farms, and that's out of Stockton. Oh, so that's it's a local. Mm -hmm. Okay. And then, how many different varieties of mushrooms do you have in there? There's three. There's uh, blackfoot, yellowfoot, chanterelle, and I think there's some wood ear in there. What so. are your favorite types to cook with? I like chanterelles. They're my favorite mushroom. Nice. So, what else will you guys be serving on New Year's? Oh, we have salmon. We have uh, we have a giant T-bone steak. Mm -hmm. We have swordfish. Our menu's pretty, pretty vast.